Hello everybody, you guys wanted me to do a mountain goat hunt after the last video we uploaded here on the channel, so I figured let's go ahead and jump straight into it. This should be quite a fun hunt to do as we have not gone after mountain goats in a very long time, or at least a hunt where we targeted them specifically, because nowadays they're just kind of difficult to find. And you may have noticed after those first couple of shots that we're using the 6.5, which is one of my favorite rifles in the game. I definitely think it's very underrated uh, due to the fact that it's just not as powerful as some other rifles in its class range. But it honestly has an amazing sound. It looks incredible and it's pretty decent at long distance and has a really nice amount of penetration. I mean, that's going to get the job done every single time right there. Now, one of the tough things about mountain goats is they do not have a drink time, which means you're only going to be hunting them in feed zones and resting zones, which can make it very difficult to find a large amount of them in a short amount of time. But some people actually really do like that part about stuff like the mountain goats where they don't have drink zones because it makes it so getting a trophy of them is a lot more rare than something like a white tailed deer. So we're going to be going for quite the jog today as there's a, there's a good range that they can be pretty much throughout this entire area in Sun Sisters. Uh, clear throughout all of this as well. So yeah, this is going to be a tough one. They can also even be down in this area. So we've got a long ways to go. Oh, did I mention they could they could also be down here? Oh, and over in this area as well. Yeah, there's a lot of places that they can be. This is probably not something that I'm going to be able to do in just one day, but I'd like to be able to go throughout my entire like range where mountain goats can be and just make sure that we don't have anything like a diamond chilling on the map. Because if I'm not mistaken, I don't think we've hunted mountain goats since they did the rework to SRP, which means we've never seen any of the mountain goats on this map, aside from those ones that we just shot. And that's a mountain goat right there. Let's go ahead and get lined up on him. And that is going to be a heart shot. Down he goes. There's that little level two that we managed to get that heart shot on. Yeah, that's gonna, that's gonna take him down every time. I just heard another one as well. But where? There we go. There it is. It's crazy how quickly we're finding these mountain goats, even with them not having a drink time. It's pretty tough to find all the places that they're feeding since their range is pretty wide. So I'm very happy that we've been able to take down four of them already. Now, hopefully that continues because it could very well slow down as we go. I'm sure we'll hit a few like dead periods where we're not finding much, but at least at the uh, starting area, we're not doing too bad. We started this outpost and almost immediately found a zone for mountain goats. Finally, we have found ourselves some more mountain goats. Uh, that's a couple of females, but I'm just happy to see anything as we've traveled this far up without seeing anything else until now. So it's just nice to see a couple of goats. We're going to try and get close and see if maybe we can get a, get a shot into a couple of them as if there's a male, we definitely want to take him down. There we go. There is some more mountain goats. Once again, this is actually a different group than the one that we just looked at, but these guys are in a uh, slightly better location. So we uh, are probably going to take down one of these first. The uh, females kept running away, so I just decided not to go after them. And instead, we've got ourselves a few males right here, including a couple of threes and one four. Let's take down the four if we can. And might as well get the threes as well. And there they go. They are now dipping out of here. So it actually looks like we ended up killing all three of them, which is nice. We managed to get a vital hit into all of these mountain goats. That one being from 293 meters away with the 6.5. This gun really is an awesome rifle to use at long range. It's just so much fun. And I mean, in real life, if I'm not mistaken, I'm pretty sure 6.5 is meant to be a uh, decently capable cartridge at long range so it makes sense that it would be decent and there is the last one right there that is a level three white fur type uh, mountain goat 88.47 on the score we're getting a lot of decent golds today which is really nice hoping that one of these decent golds will end up respawning as a decent diamond if we're lucky that would definitely be really nice Ooh, there we go we got ourselves another mountain goat unfortunately this one right here is alert so we're gonna have to shoot it pretty quickly oh there's another one right there which one do i go for uh, I think we go for both of them, honestly. We did it. We pulled it off. I wasn't sure if that second shot was going to get off quick enough, but we did manage to squeeze off the second shot and get the second goat down. 
Man, these goats have took us all over the map. We started here, we ended up over here, and then have finally got over to this part. And now we're going to kind of go through like this range here. And if we don't find anything, we're going to head down to uh, the Prosperity Pass area over in uh, like this section of the map. Hoping that we'll find more than just the three different zones that we found so far because so far they're very widely spread throughout their uh, their home range, which is a little bit unfortunate. I was hoping they would be a little bit more condensed and maybe we could find a couple of zones really close to each other, but that has not been the case at all. We got more of them down here. This is actually pretty wild. You know, ask and you will receive. Those two that we shot back there were their own zone and we killed both of them so the zone is unfortunately gone but uh we found another zone that has three mountain goats with uh one of them being a pretty heavy weight there we go we briefly saw him now the question is will he actually give us a good shot i don't know what direction he's going there he is oh they're fleeing oh my gosh they're fleeing that's not good that's not what i was hoping to see i don't know if any of those hit right there I don't know if any of those shots hit, but I'm really hoping that at least one of them did. It'd be a shame if we didn't get anything out of that group. Oh man, there we go. Where is he? I don't know how this is going to end. We hit him. So he probably will die at some point. Unfortunately, I did not get a good shot on that mountain goat that we took a shot at earlier. But uh, this mountain goat, he doesn't seem to know what he wants to do. So we might actually be able to get another shot into him and save him. Actually, he's already down. Well, that was a very interesting encounter. Just a, a bighorn sheep running all around us. I, I think I might have just called him a mountain goat a second ago. But this is indeed a bighorn sheep. And uh, we actually got the kill on him. Unlike that mountain goat that I apparently shot in like the leg or something because he didn't die. Well, that appears to be a mountain goat right there and also over here. So we have once again found an area with multiple mountain goats. The question is, can we kill this other one or are they going to stay hidden? It looks like we have actually got them in view, so that's nice. Bunch of them there as well. Man, we might have two zones here. That would actually be kind of crazy if we have two good zones side by side. Uh, let's go ahead and get this guy down if we can. And that one as well. Beautiful. Now the question is, can we get a view on this guy as he's running away? Probably not. So that's a little unfortunate, but it is what it is. We'll have to go to his zone and see if he was the only one there. There is that level 3, 79.99. Almost hit 80, but just not quite there. I don't remember if this was the larger or smaller one that we just picked up. So let's see. That was definitely the larger one because this guy is much smaller, unfortunately. 74.82. Okay, so this is actually a zone of three and we only spotted one of them. There's a couple that we still have yet to see. And who knows what they could have been. I think we should probably try to figure out where they went and just see at least what levels they were. Oh, 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 that's a five. Oh my gosh. I, that's not even the same one, I don't think. I don't see any others with this guy. Oh my gosh, well that came out of nowhere. We have traveled literally all over the map today, starting here, going all the way over here, cutting across and going through this entire area. And we have finally ran into something that is at least, has a chance of being something crazy. Oh my gosh, and it, he did have another one with him? I, I don't know where that guy was, but apparently he's got another one with him as well, so we need to at least get a look at that one too. But uh, we, got, we got something else to do first. We got to track this guy down and hope that he ends up being a diamond. It's been a bit since I've seen a level 5 for the mountain goat, so this is something we got to make sure we get a good shot on, and in fact, he's right there. Can we potentially get a good shot on him? Now, he very well could troll. I know the mountain goats do troll a good bit. So we're going to hope that doesn't happen here. Because that would be quite crushing to have found a level 5 goat and then have it troll us. Okay, he went to nervous. He has gone to nervous, so we should be able to take him down shortly then. Let's see if we can back up and actually get a good view on him. 
The further up we get, the better visibility we'll have of this guy. I think he actually just stopped to eat. I think he is literally... Yeah, he literally started eating right there. Let's see if we can get him to move with the 22 trick. There we go. He is now alerted. And that should be a solid hit. It is. He's going down. 6.5 will kill them pretty slowly with a single lung shot, so it should have been a good shot. That is crazy. Yeah, that is vital blood. Man, we shot this guy in the middle of a road. That is a... Uh, that's a whole new meaning to roadkill. And there we go. There is our level 5 mountain goat. Let's see if this guy ends up making it. I'm hoping for the best, but preparing for the worst as I've had a lot of, uh, I've had a lot of trolls in the past. This is also a troll. Oh, man. Well, that's unfortunate. That is a sad ending to this hunt. But, I mean, we still have some of the map that we haven't checked, so maybe in a future video we'll go to the, like, Prosperity Pass area of the map and do a final little scavenge. In fact, I think there's another spot as well that we did not search, so we got a couple areas left. Uh, if I remember, I'll put it up on screen, like, what areas we haven't gone to. But we really need to search those areas as well, because uh, I need redemption after this. After getting trolled... For the first time by a mountain goat in months and months and months at this point. In fact, probably close to a year uh, since we had seen a level 5 medium mountain goat and then getting trolled by it. I need redemption. We need to get ourselves a good mountain goat. And who knows, maybe I'll even jump into some multiplayer and search some of the feed zones for them because now I kind of know where to go, so maybe we'll be able to find some in multiplayer, but unfortunate this guy didn't make it thank you all for watching the video if you enjoyed leave a comment down below and also click that like button as well as subscribing if you're brand new to the channel and enjoy this type of content and if you're already subscribed and you haven't turned on the notifications well why haven't you it's going to make it so you can see the videos quicker which will help you get to see them as soon as they're posted and it'll help the channel because it gets the videos out to people a little bit more reliably but thank you all for being here and i will see you all in the next one peace